Good morning. Let's zoom out. I'm going to show the uh, zombie tarot again, but this time with a better setup, better camera. Oh, it looks like our friend is in here. Dude, what are you doing? You're not a zombie, you're a skeleton. And it looks like he's experiencing fall weather, so he's put on his mitten. Which can be, uh, how do you do this? Hmm. Well, I guess I don't. Because I can't figure it out. Ah. It's that simple. You can just fold it over and you can put your hand in there. If you can see that. So, you can keep your fingers warm or have them out and use them. I don't know where I got these gloves, but they're pretty nice. So we'll put you over here, kind of out of the way. This is the zombie Terra, which I think has been shown a gazillion times, probably. But here we go again. <laughs> Hopefully this one's a, a bit clearer than some of the others. So it's, it's good to look at in case you're interested or thinking about it. But it comes in a great box of all the boxes. I mean, this one's excellent. Look, there's some cards in it, and it'll still open pretty easy. See it falling out in a spooky manner? That's kind of kind of cool. Sides got bullets all over it because you're gonna need those when they attack. And the inside is like a, I don't know, it's fakey, but it it's still it's lined like a velvet. I kept this so the cards. I don't have to turn it upside down. It's a cheap version of a ribbon. And that's it inside. Nice and dark. We'll look at it closed up again. It just works really well. For once it wasn't dented. In the event of a zombie attack. Would I use this? No. <laughs> Maybe at some kind of themed tarot like party. If I ever went to such a thing or if we had that sort of thing back when we did readings all we did was dress up the place we didn't do anything special insight and ammunition <laughs> and it does come with a book and let's compare the book to the fool card look at that because it fits in the exact same area where the cards are even this edge is rounded like a card this is still straight, because I guess it has to be. But look at the inside. It's like an old newspaper or something. You know, aged. That's cool. And it does have the images, again, for the Trumps at least. That's interesting. The minor arcana. Uh, has those two. It has the cups. So we're going to be seeing cups, wands, swords, and then something different. Yeah, hazards. I'm not sure what. I would think all of this would be hazardous. The ace of hazards. <laughs> but there will be other, you know, review type reviews out there that are much better than this. I'm just showing the cards. I'd, See, like old magazines, newspapers, comic books, those ads at the back, trained zombie, <laughs> that's cool, he's got the turban, he's going to prophesize, also saw these, it's been a while now, but uh, it's zombie playing cards, I might show those, there's Nothing, you know, tarot, divination, oracle, whatever. There's none of that in there. So I'll put those aside. Uh, sorry, I knocked these around. I'm having some alignment issues, I think. I'll see what we can do. That little grid thing up there kind of helps. I'm not doing the TV today. That didn't help very much. Plus... Once you connect the HDMI cable to it, you can't 
uh, you have to lower the resolution because it won't stream to that TV anyway. I guess I would need an HD, Ultra, whatever kind of TV. But there's the full card. <laughs> That's what the backs look like. Obviously, you can tell up from down, but I'll do it anyway. That's a nice, I think, a nice card. Would I sh riffle shuffle? Probably not, because I want to keep it f flat. I mean, if I were to get invited to an October tarot party, <laughs> I, I wouldn't riffle shuffle, rifle shuffle, or maybe overhand shuffle, or do the sideways, or just spread them out somewhere and mush them around and then pick them up just to preserve them but they have a like an old cardboard like feel I guess that's on purpose so here's the rest uh, the trumps three rows of seven like usual so I give you a good look at those before I bring in before I bring in some other things <laughs> right yep you get out of the way you're trying to upstage everybody. That's how skeletons are. They always got to be the center of attention. I'm not very big on... Um, by that, I mean I don't watch a lot of horror movies. I will watch, you know... What will I watch? I will watch the old Frankenstein again. I might watch young Frankenstein again, just because that's kind of funny. And watch... Um, well, I'll watch several vampire movies, but... Not some of the newer ones. I mean, I don't know. Something like Priest gets a bit, a bit too much, a bit too, I don't know, violent and weird. If those were vampires, I'm not sure. I guess they weren't. I'm probably thinking some other movies. But the older ones are, you know, kind of lightweight. I'm sure they weren't back then, but they are now. And maybe watch that one again that's about zombies called uh i don't think I, that might be the only one i've ever seen no nah, i saw something at a drive-in uh the movie was called warm bodies of course it has the australian eye candy in it uh what's her name P -p 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 Teresa palmer Teresa palmer this was the ones here comes the swords I'll just put it over here. And let's look at these. I saw a Nazi somewhere or something. That looked like a Nazi on a tank. Kind of your worst nightmare. Here come Nazi zombies on tanks. This is well done, whoever did this. I'm assuming I got it on Amazon, of course. Really, you've come to dislike Amazon. Although I noticed um, for a little stretch there, or recently, I should say, if I order just one thing, like a deck or a book, like a paper book, Kindle books work great. I don't got a problem with that, except their price. They're almost to the cost I saw a few that were more than the paper book, which makes absolutely no sense to me. I know there's some effort involved. I know that from trying to convert various project documentation into PDFs and that sort of thing. But um, uh, if I order one, it usually comes, uh, you know, like the Postal Service, USPS, and it's reliable, or it's UPS. I don't know. Maybe they got some issues. I don't, I don't get it sometimes. So it's kind of put me off. See if he likes something in particular. What do he see? What do you like? He thinks he likes that one. Well, no one. No one cares much, okay? So let's bring in the last one. Even though I've lost, turned off my timer, so I can't tell. 
Gosh darn it. I guess I'll have to fix that for the next one. And last but not least, I guess, are the hazards. And I'm not sure what that is, but I like this one. <laughs> kind of the Frankenstein kind of thing. Head in a jar. He don't look happy. I can't read the little words. Do not open, it says. So that was my, hopefully quick enough, can't tell, show of the zombie tarot. I'll put the book back in here. I'll put this back in here, the box. Look at that. I just love that box. It goes down by itself. It's probably causing the camera all kinds of issues. And then we'll put our friend back in here. Well, hopefully you're not a friend that I've known. And... Just let you kind of hang there. And with that, I'll say peace. <laughs>